Would you like to learn the next 100 to 1000 X meme coins with the potential to turn $1,000 into 100,000 if not a million dollars? I'm going to be ranking the following meme coins for their multiplier potential. The cryptocurrency market has taken an enormous dump in the last 48 hours. But one segment of the market soaring right now is meme coins with book of meme going up 400x in the last couple of days entering into the top 100 cryptocurrency. So what meme coins should you be looking at in order to generate wealth in the next bull market? My name is the Supo Man, your superhero of 100 to 1000x altcoins. I have been in cryptocurrency for seven years and I have called some of the most famous cryptocurrency pumps. So if you love content like this, make sure that you smash a like on this video, subscribe so you never miss out on the alpha, you never miss out on the cryptocurrencies that are likely to make the huge gains. And if you want to know what I am buying in real time, including meme coins, then make sure that you join my cryptocurrency investment course for $10 with the link in the description. You will be able to join my buy announcements telegram channel and chat group meme coins have been exploding and one of the biggest success stories is this one book of meme which came out three days ago and has gone on to make 400x plus for early investors now the reason book of meme has done extremely well is because of the growth of solana solana is defying belief by getting extremely close to its all-time high and this cryptocurrency Dog with hat has actually been a massive success story for Solana. So everybody's looking for the next dog with hat. Turned $1,800 into $11 million in three months. So there is extreme hunger and greed for the next top meme coin. As usual, nothing I say is to be construed as financial advice. Crypto is largely unregulated and high risk and people who invest should be prepared to lose all their money. And everything I see to you in this video is for informational and educational purposes only. One of the big success stories in this meme season has been Hemule. Hemule is a cryptocurrency that I spoke about 20x ago, and it went on to make a 50x from the point I spoke about it. Now, Hemule is the cat of Vitalik. Now, what people don't know is that there is another cat in the Buterin family called Tigra. Tigra is the twin to Hemule and Maya Buterin has been posting pictures of Tigra and Maya Buterin is Vitalik's stepmother. So there is a meme coin called Tigra. So where we have had the explosive growth of Hemule, now we've got the potential for the explosive growth of Tigra. Now when I spoke about Hemule, it was 1.4 million in market cap. Today is 35 million and it has been higher. Tigra is pretty much the exact same price Hemule was when I first spoke about it. Now, what I will say is, is that the website looks exactly like the website for Hemule. But I don't think it really matters because what meme coins come down to is speculation. So I would say that Tigra does have the potential to replicate what Hemule does. So it could do a 50x long term, it could do even more than that. But as I said, meme coins are extremely speculative. They are not supported by strong fundamentals. So you have to bear in mind that when you invest in a meme coin, you could be investing into a sinkhole. There are a lot of developers of Solana based meme coins right now that see the opportunity to release a meme coin, maybe using a keyword, and then people invest in it, and then they just take the money, they suck it out. There is extreme risk of loss with meme coins. One of the best performing newer meme coins is Bonk. Bonk was the first meme coin on Solana and this has done a 100x twice. There exists a meme coin called Bonk 2.0. If you missed Bonk, here is your second chance, Bonk 2. Now this is listed on a ton of different exchanges so the liquidity is much higher and therefore the chance of being rug pulled are not as bad as you get with some of the newer Solana meme coins. Now these guys are looking to be multi-narrative focused. Bonk 2.0 is presently 5.5 million in market cap. And compared to Bonk, 
This makes it nearly 300x less in market cap, double the volume than its market cap, showing that it has got a lot of interest. So Bong 2.0 could also do something along the lines of 50x. Another fantastic performer has been MAGA, which stands for Make Crypto Great Again. Now, this is a Donald Trump coin, and because he is going for the presidency in the US, of course, this has got a large amount of interest. And as a result of that, MAGA is now a $229 million market cap. This meme coin here, Super Trump. Now, Super Trump is a bit like Bonk 2.0. Missed MAGA? Don't miss Super Trump. Now, this one is a much smaller version of MAGA. The market cap is a mere 13.8 million, which makes it a whole 20x cheaper than the Marga coin. And the branding is superb. Look at it. It just looks absolutely insane. And the marketing is clearly on point because they have got 3 million in volume. This one has also got extreme potential. As we get closer to the actual elections at the end of the year, then we could see Marga doing well. And as a result of that, we could be seeing Super Trump being taken up with it. 25 to 30x is presently 20x less than MAGA. So if MAGA was to do another 10x, then this one has got the potential to 25 to 50x. We have already touched upon the success of Book of Meme. Book of Meme went from obscurity, a few thousand in market cap, to now being over a billion dollars in market cap. So Book of Meme is extremely popular right now. Now, there is a cryptocurrency that is a derivative of Book of Meme, and that is this one here, Book of Pepe. Now, Book of Pepe is worth a minute $691,000 market cap. Now, if you have a look, on Dex Tools, it's got a very, very low score. The reason being is although there's nothing wrong with the contract, there's no buy and sell tax, there is also no website because this is extremely new. So this is purely speculative. It's got that book of, and it's got Pepe in it as well. And Pepe is one of the strongest meme coin performers in the last couple of weeks. As a result of that, this one could do anything from a 10x to a 100x. It all depends on what the team do. Do the team release a website? Is there longevity? Is this not a sinkhole? In which case, this could do extremely well from being well under $1 million in market cap. Now, if you thought Book of Pepe was degenerative, this one takes it to the next extreme. This one is called House of Meme. So you've got Book of Meme, now this is House of Meme, and this is a Solana-based meme coin. Now, this has got a market cap of $24,000. Again, these guys have not got a website. If you go on the Twitter, it's got hardly any followers, 17 followers. This is a complete speculative bet that I don't think has really gone anywhere because nobody really knows about House of Meme. So, this one's purely speculative. How much lower can it go than 24K? Of course, it can go lower. You could lose everything. But if we're looking at the market caps of the cryptocurrency it's based on, 1 billion, at 24K, can you make much of a mistake? At 24K, are you leaving yourself a lot of room to the upside? Yes, you are. But like I said, it is a risk. As a result of that, House of Meme could literally do anything from 5X to 500x. If this was still 1000x, it would be worth 24 million, which is still a micro cap. So this does have massive potential for the upside. Having said that, it's extremely degenerative. I am going to say that this could do a 50x. Dog with hat is one of the most successful meme coins there's ever been, and probably equal to Bonk in terms of most successful meme coin on Solana. Now, if you ever look at this, if this is just ridiculous, if you think about it, look, why did this make millionaires? Like, you can understand with Shiba, because there's a variation of Doge. But why this? I mean, why has this done so super well? No one knows. In a lot of cases, you just can't explain it. I would say that a lot of the reason why meme coin holders become millionaires is because they are attached to insiders who just know stuff and therefore they're able to turn $1,800 into $11 million.
But dog with hat, if you think about it, is just literally a dog with a hat. I mean, it's nothing more than that. Has it offers no more utility than that. And there's a new one, which is called ape with hat, or ape with hat. Literally just an ape with a hat. So it's a variation on dog with hat, but a much lower market cap. If we have a look at dog with hat, we can see it's a $2.3 billion cryptocurrency based purely on some random dog with a hat on, right? Now, ape with hat is only 8 million. And this has got a like for like volume. So 8 million market cap, 8 million volume shows it's extremely trendy right now. And all of its supply is out. Now, always the original does the best. It's, it's very, very rare that you see a deviation of something doing better than the original. But having said that, this has got a lot of investment, has had a lot of trading action. So I would say that Ape with Hat has also got that 50x potential. The next one is Dragon Ball Z Tribute Token. Now, the reason why I'm bringing this one up is because what I've heard on the grapevine is that the person that helped Super Trump and Meme AI with marketing is also behind helping the Dragon Ball Z token. And you can see this has got excellent website design. Is it what I would say the same as Super Trump? No. But I would say that just purely based on who could be marketing this in the future, and the fact it's already a 4 million market cap, means this one could have an outside chance of doing well. I'm going to put this one in 25x. The next one is Le Miao. Now, I have seen a lot of mutterings about this on Twitter. It quite clearly has a lot of popularity, and I know quite a few whales who have bought a ton of Le Miao. Now, what is Le Miao? Le Miao is a cat based meme coin. So you've had the likes of Doge, Shiba, Flocky, Dog with Hat, Bonk, a ton of dog related cryptocurrencies that have gone on to do super well. The animal class, which seems to be underrepresented, is cats. So Le Miao is a cat based cryptocurrency. And I believe that the actual term for it came from Edward Snowden, but I have heard it from various other people. Like if you're responding to a bitchy remark or something. So I would say that Le Miao has got a lot of potential. Le Miao presently is only $10 million in market cap. Now, like I said, I know of a few whales that have got Le Miao. So I think it's worth taking the risk. Le Miao has gone down 3x. So this seems like an okay time to buy it. In the last 24 hours, it's down 38%. So I would say that Le Miao at a $10 million market cap, considering a lot of dog-based cryptocurrencies have gone into the billions, if not halfway there, then at 10 million fully diluted, this one has got an outside chance of doing extremely well. And this could also do a 50x. This is one of the internet's biggest memes, success kid. Now, Pepe was one of the biggest internet memes, and that went on to become a multi-billion dollar cryptocurrency. Success Kid presently is not even a million dollars. So Success Kid is available on ETH and on Solana. My personal favorite is the Solana coin, simply because it's much easier and cheaper to transact, especially with ETH gas fees, how they are right now. So the Success Kid meme is exploited by and represented by the Success Kid cryptocurrency. So if you want exposure to one of the greatest memes on the internet, then where you get it from is from the Success Kid cryptocurrency. Now, I personally think, again, this one could do super well. Not a lot of people know about it. It's a three to one ratio, 205,000 versus a $657,000 market cap. Again, memes that have got incredible brand recognition, like Pepe, like Doge, go into the multiple billions, and this one's not even a million. So with the right set of circumstances, this one could be a mega multiplier. Now, if it was pumped by insiders, it would be a lot higher right now. So maybe people just don't know about it. But I'm going to say that Success Kid has got the opportunity to do extremely well, potentially. The next one is more than just a meme coin. Astro Pepe X enables you to deploy your own cryptocurrency. This is 7 million with 2 million in volume. This is AI mixed with meme. So what you can do is you can use 
their AI functionality to create the ultimate meme coin. So this is a meme coin with fundamentals. It's like token fight mixed with AI. So I would say this one has also got supreme potential. Looking at TokenFi, which is which is 62 million in market cap and 628 million in fully diluted value, Astro Pepe being 100x less in fully diluted value could have some extremely high upside. I would say that this one could do 50x. Kokinu has established itself as the main meme coin of Avalanche. But the second meme coin on Avalanche is definitely, in my opinion anyway, Land Wolf. Land Wolf is presently 10x less than Cock In You. Now, it has had quite a lot of upside lately. I spoke about this extremely early when it had much more zeros in it. But I think that Land Wolf is still an incredible cryptocurrency with some good brand identity and a lot of whales I know are bullish on Land Wolf. So I would say that Land Wolf has got the potential by the end of the next bull run, because I don't see this actually going anywhere. I don't see this being a flash in the pan, doing well just because meme coins are doing well. I think this could do well long term. I would say that this one could also achieve, from where it is right now, 25 to 50x. Mog is a cryptocurrency I have presently not bought, but I'm very, very interested in it, because I know a lot of influencers that are in Mog. Mog is presently 290 million in market cap and it's nearly fully diluted. So I would say that this one has got more room to the upside if you let it drop. This one has gone up 20x in the last month. So I'm going to wait for this one to come down because again this is a cap based meme, probably one of the most famous that exists in cryptocurrency and could be the doge for cats in the cryptocurrency market. So I would say that this one has got 25x potential by the end of this bull market. The last one is Bobo. Bobo the bear. I have seen so many people making a noise about this on Twitter that I could foresee that this one has some great upside. Now, this is presently 73 million in fully diluted value. It has had a big run up in the last couple of months. So I would, again, wait for this one to come down. Now, Bobo, the reason I like it is because it's a lot like Pepe. Very, very easy, very small brand name, but very easily recognizable. It's got the bear and it's got the red. So this one has got good brand identity, I would say. It's got a good name also, Bobo. So I would say that this one has also got potentially 25x potential by the end of the next bull market. So there we are. Those are meme coins and reasons why I believe they could do very, very well because there's a lot of greed in the market right now for meme coins. The reason being is because it's just so super easy to make money with meme coins. Why? Because they don't have VCs, they don't have large entities that bought at pre-sale and can sell off. A lot of the coins that you're buying into are completely out in circulation. It's got open distribution and it's much easier to make multipliers. Plus, whales love meme coins. A lot of the reason why you see incredibly high volumes in meme coins is because they're super easy to procure and super playful for the whales. So it's a very, very good tool for whales in order to generate large amounts of money because they're not dealing with VCs, they're not dealing with large vesting periods, they're not dealing with founders who don't give them many coins. So they've got a completely open canvas with memes. And this is why memes are so explosive and why you shouldn't fade them. But what I will say is it's also the one with infinite competition and is the hardest to make money. Why? Because for every thousand meme coins that get released, only about five do super well and make you enormous amounts of wealth. So while everybody wants to be the subject of the next success story, like the trader that turned $8,000 into 5.7 million, how a trader turned 1,800 into 11 million, how a trader turned $250 into 5 million. Everybody wants that success story. And that's only something you can get from meme coins, but it's extremely hard and really one in a thousand people actually become truly successful with meme coins. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. It is lights out, all out.